How are you? Welcome in this uh, new video uh, in which I'm going to be quick. Uh, I'm going to deal in this quick tutorial with the uh, common issue that uh, we encounter in when dealing with the HP BIOS issues. It's this issue which you see here in the screen. Product information not valid. The following product information programmed into the system board is missing or invalid. Uh, so this issue always comes after uh, we program our BIOS chip with uh, a different dump which is not the original one of our board. So I got to a recent uh, case with an HP, uh, it's an i5 sixth generation which has been in other shops and uh, uh, in fact has so many issues and among these issues this one of the BIOS uh, missing or invalid information so uh, if you browse the internet you may find uh, so many ways of dealing with this kind of issues with HP uh, and uh, for uh, technicians and uh, people dealing with repairing I really advise them to always back up the original dump even if it's corrupted we still can uh, extract these informations uh, in it so that we can use them with our uh, with another damp of course or we just may uh, repair the original damp if it can be repaired and uh, we avoid ourselves getting in trouble with uh, this uh, this issue of invalid information so uh, personally I, or I uh, do it in a very quick way which uh, in which I'm using the the BCU the BIOS configuration utility of HP which can be downloaded from uh, the internet so let's download it first I don't know if uh, it's still installed in my post but anyway let's download it again HP BCU yes download okay uh, the first one so we download okay and we execute the file so yes we accept everything and we install it that's it okay so i was saying i used uh, the bcu uh, the utility of uh, hp to uh, save or to write those informations in the BIOS but uh, what I do is I always uh, work from a Windows environment either live Windows or in, uh, uh, in the Windows uh, if it was installed in the machine on which I am working if